Hey guys, today I'm going to do a review on the Nike Sweet Classic high top shoes. Um, I got them about like, a month ago and I've sort of worn them a bit, so they might not look as new, but they're still good. Here, let's get into it. So, see in the front has a um, tongue, the laces, the front, it's all leather, black. There's a Nike symbol right here, the swoosh right here, the back, there's the Nike symbol right there, and the bottom right there, and the bottom is the Nike symbol right there. The colors on the shoes I got are metallic silver, uh, blue, which is um, on the stripe at the bottom, I don't think you can see it. Um, the Nike symbol on the back, Nike is written in blue, and the, the inside of it is blue too. When I got the shoes, I didn't really get any laces with it, I just got these black ones. But I could have just bought, uh, you know, some I put like white laces on them or something. Um, right now I have them laced loosely. Because, like, um, I, I usually wear jeans with these because it, it's fall right now and it's kind of cold. So, I don't, I don't really wear shorts. But when I do wear shorts, I, I tighten them tight all the way to the top. Because um, the lace sole goes from here and it ends all the way at to the top. So, yeah, it makes it look better with shorts. So, the thing I like about these shoes is. If you get like dirt on them or something, they're so easy to clean. It's just one wipe and they're gone with like a wet rag or something. But in the sides and the like the side bottom sides are really hard to clean. I don't think you can with like a wet rag. I've tried everything. And um, yeah, so these are size um, 11.5, 11 and a half. This is the box, Nike Sportswear box. So, just official. Oh, sorry, 10.5. Never mind. Not 11.5, 10.5. .5. What I recommend doing if you're getting these shoes or like any Nike shoes is to get a size like larger than you actually are. Say if you're size 10, try getting a size 11 or just 10.5 because um, sometimes they might like feel a bit tight on you even though that's your right shoe size but if you do get a larger size, they're, they're really comfortable, they're durable, like, um, like look at that. And it just goes right back to place, doesn't really make a mark. And the bottom's really grippy. You can wear it in the court if you want, basketball court. It won't really do anything. But they're not really running shoes though. They're flat bottom. You can't skateboard in them. Well, I've never tried, but uh, yeah, this, I got mine for about hundred bucks. I think that it's dropped down now, but uh, I'm not sure though. I got mine at Chance, so. Yeah, you should uh, pick up a pair if you can. It's just a great shoe. They look really good. Like, uh, like mine, they're a bit worn out, just a bit, but it still looks good though. It's my camera that makes it look worn out from the tongue. It's just my camera, but. It's actually it looks really cool though. So this is my shoe that I got is all leather, right? You can get other kinds of sweet classics, high, but like with all suede and um, like just all um, like the Nike Sweet Classic canvas. It's just all like um, yeah, it's thin and. Uh, yeah, it looks better, but I, I picked these ones because they're more durable, and um, 
I was gonna pick the white ones, but I just chose the black ones. It comes in lots of colors. It comes in uh, black, like black, the ones I have, black, blue, and silver, black and white, um, black and red, black and um, just black and silver, uh, white, all white, um, white and black, like white and green, which looks really cool. Yeah, you can get, you can, you can find them anywhere. You just go to your nearest Nike store. The, the most likely they'll be there. And so yeah, this is a review on the Nike Sweet Classic high top shoes. Thanks for watching.